Welcome to Everyday Cooking. Today we are going to prepare rice crackers. This will be very crispy and will taste so so good. For the recipe, pour some ghee in a pan and in this we are going to fry some cashew nuts. Here the cashew nuts got fried well, we can take it out. In the leftover ghee, let us add few almonds and roast them. Our almonds are ready, let us take it out. Next we are going to roast a small piece of chopped coconut. Let the coconut turn slightly brown. At this stage you can take it out. Next is raisins. The quantities of cashews, almonds, coconut and raisins are up to you. You can take less or more. So here the raisins are also ready. Set this aside. Now take a pan, add enough oil for frying. Once the oil is hot enough for frying, add 1 cup of rice into it and fry them. You don't need to add the whole cup of rice at once. If you want, you can fry them in portions. So here is my 1 cup of fried rice, set this aside. Take a plate or a tray and line it with a butter paper that is parchment paper. Grease this with ghee or butter. If you don't have parchment paper, directly grease the plate or the tray. Our tray is ready, next let us caramelize the sugar. For this take half a cup of sugar and a quarter cup of water. Let the sugar melt and caramelize. So here the sugar got caramelized, you have to switch off the flame when it is golden brown. To this add the fried rice. And the fried nuts and raisins. Give this a nice mix. Let us transfer this into the greased tray and shape it. You can shape this thin or thick, it is up to you. When it cools down, this will become thick like a candy. So if you want to give it to the kids, just shape it thin. Now let us leave this until it gets set. Once it cools down, this will become thick. So mostly this will get set within one hour. This is all set now. Let us cut it into pieces. So here are our crispy rice crackers. Hope you like the recipe. We'll join you in another interesting recipe. Do like, share and comment our videos and don't forget to subscribe our channel.